Ozella in Crystal River. We're at Ozella Park and Boat Ramp. Uh, we're going to do some night fishing, but there's signs all over here. It says, Park is open from dawn to dusk and no camping. Well, here's the thing. I'm probably going to be up until 4 in the morning fishing. I don't know how they can stop me from using the Gulf of Mexico to fish. Uh, so, I don't know. We're going to check it out. We're going to do a little bit of fishing. And I'll be back with you. Okay, guys. So, sorry about the wind. We are on the coast. Um, so, we parked right back there. And, um, shoot. There we go. But, right over there from us, this is the ramp part right here. Uh, they got a tent and stuff set up there, so I don't know. Hopefully they don't say anything to me because, you know, I, I just, this is ridiculous. You know, everywhere you go, you know, no, no overnight camping or, you know, you can't be there from dusk till dawn. And I, I understand, you know, the, uh, what they're trying to do about, you know, people that aren't the greatest, you know criminal activity and stuff I, I do I get it. I understand all that but you know it's it's up to me for my safety you know to take care of my safety not the government and uh, it's what the second moon was written for to protect us from the government um, just you, you know how I don't understand you know city ordinance doesn't trump my God-given rights to come out and catch a fish if I want to um, but so I'm going to get baited up here and I did bring my squid this time. I'm going to try squid first. I'm just going to try to cast out here. Monkey says it's beautiful over there, but yeah, I see they got a tent set up. So hopefully they don't say anything to either one of us, you know, but, uh, yeah. So I'll kick you back on again. Sorry about the wind. I'll kick you back on once I get out here. Um, I know you're on the wrong side of me, but if I put you over here, I'm afraid the sun. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it looks like it's dark in this camera right now, and I don't know why. I might be able to lighten it up here. Hopefully that's not overexposing you. So, all right, guys. I'll be back with you shortly. Hang tight, but hopefully we'll get to sleep in the car. Uh, hopefully they won't say anything. Um... We're not far from the house, but it's a 10 mile drive just to get to the main road. And then it's only like 18 minutes after that to the house. So, but this is a long windy road. It's really, it's really nice back in here. So I see a couple kayakers. All right, I'm gonna get, get my bait cut up and get a line out in the water. Okay guys, so I am getting some bites here. I think I just got a snag. Hey. There's a fish on it. There was a fish on it. The wind is blowing my line to the rock. That's the way the wind's blowing that way. So no matter how hard I cast out here to my left, it's still blowing it back. It's pushing me into this coral. They're biting. I'll leave you roll for a minute. It's blown it that way, even though I cast it that way. So I'm gonna have to get a heavier weight, heavier sinker. You can see my line. Just went over into these rocks again. Ah. 
Hot one. Now let's see if we can get the Black Max out here. There is a manatee right out in front of me. Monkey seen a couple over here behind me where she's at. Catch a couple of them, I might keep them for some bait. Ugh. Got my hat in the truck. Yeah, little ones. mess around a little bit. I'll keep you back on. If I catch something, I know you don't want to hear that wind. Bait fish. <laughs> I don't know how well monkey's doing. That's number three. Two fish and a and a crab. Fortunately, he's too small to eat, so we'll throw him back. Wow. He just got off. I went over to check on Monkey and came back. And I got a friend. I ain't sure what that thing is. Not sure what this thing is, but he's got a bunch of little teeth. He's got a barb on each side the back of his head. He's got spikes on his tail. Weird, glad I didn't touch it. Okay guys, monkey's getting hungry, so and they took the grills out. Last time we, we were here, there were two or three of them, maybe even four over there. They took them all out. Though they did put a new picnic table in, but they took the grills out. So, um, monkey some food cooked up here. This is what we're gonna have. So, let me get a knife, let me get this open, and um, then we'll start cooking. Okay. Man, it's a, still a little breezy, but the mosquitoes are still out. They don't care. They don't care one bit. Okay. 
Okay, I know I'm going to need a glove. I'm not sure where I put my gloves. But anyway, that's what we're doing. We got some ham or uh, hot dog buns in there. Just going to cook a couple of these up, throw them on a hot dog bun. Okay, so we ate. I made monkeys first. I made mine and then I ate an extra piece because I had a piece left over. Well, there's a lot of it there. I don't know if you've seen it, but I just cut them in half. So she ate half, I ate half, and then I cut up half of a half for Bruno and I ate the other half of that one. So time to do some more fishing. Okay, there he is, guys. Number six. I don't know if I was recording a minute ago, but yep, yeah, that's number six, right on. So, there we go. Uh, caught none. Monkey has caught none, but that's okay, guys. I catch plenty for both of us. Anyhow, I gotta get this hook out of him and get him back in the water. Hi guys, number seven. No. What? That's my fish. Oh, okay. Monkey finally caught a fish tonight. Yay. What is it, 1230? Yeah, something like that. Ish. But mm -hmm. She caught one. It's about a pound, maybe a pound and a half. Good job, Monk. Thank you. Gotta get him in the water. Okay guys, so Monkey has gone to bed. It's after two, so I'm gonna step a little bit and fish a little longer. She, uh, she got another catfish. Um, it was a little bit bigger than the last one. Pound and a half going on two pounds. So, yeah, she's got two fish so far. So that's, that's good. I don't know how much fishing we'll do in the morning, but we'll see. But, uh, I'll kick you back on if I get something here. Uh, trying out my, got this green light. It's pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, so, there we go. <laughs> but, um, oh, I like that. It's not so bright. Uh, it is still windy, but it's keeping the mosquitoes away, and it's a nice, cool breeze. But every once in a while, you feel this real hot breeze come in. But, like, right now, it's really cool. It's a cool breeze. But, so, yeah, I'm going to, since she's not fishing, I'm going to spread my rods out a little bit and we'll go from there and see what happens stick around okay guys so i don't know what time it is it's late i think i'm going to crawl in the truck and get a couple catch a couple z's i've only had one bite since i caught that catfish and that was right after that catfish i haven't had a bite since I tried different spots right in here and uh nothing <laughs> so tried different you know I've tried shrimp and chicken liver just not biting it's low tide too so all right guys so that's what I'm gonna do I am going to go ahead and head to the truck pick my stuff up catch a few weeks and then I'll see you guys in the morning <laughs> good night Good morning everyone. It is 6.42 a.m. So I'm getting ready to rise. The, uh, <clears throat> the tide has come in. So I'm going to throw a line out here and see what, see if we can get something. Got a boat coming in there. Got, looks like kayakers over there. So, I'm going to get some bait on my line. I'm going to throw it out there and see what happens. Good morning, Crystal River.
All right, guys, that's it for this trip. Sorry I didn't get to bring you along with me on that last catfish I caught. <coughs> Excuse me, but I just walked over there just real quick to give it a shot, and I caught the fish. Monkey was clear over here. My camera was over here, so, uh, yeah. Uh, monkey's getting her camera. She's going to do an outro. So thanks for coming along with us, guys. It's been great. It's been real. It's been real fun. Loved it. Monkey actually got cold last night. There was a nice cool breeze coming off this, this, uh, off the coast here. What? Yeah, the Gulf Coast. Yeah. Okay, the Gulf. <laughs> so anyway, guys, the tide came in. It's up really high. Uh, they're biting a little bit, but they're little ones. We're going to go ahead and go on home. I haven't had any sleep. I know I told you last night I was going to go in and get some sleep, but I didn't. So anyway, Monkey's going over there to do her outro, and I'm doing mine right now. And I'm going to leave you with some beautiful drone footage a couple hundred feet up in the air. We're going to drive around the drone and uh, hopefully you enjoy it. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Enjoy the drone footage. We'll see you in the next one. Shea Bear, the Myth, the Man, the Legend. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye, guys. Take care.